hello guys you are welcome in this video we are going to evaluate without the use of calculator we have 9 power 7 minus 9 power 6 so what we're going to do is instead of this 9 power 7 we are going to have 9 power 6 plus 1 then we have minus 9 power 6 then we make use of this identity a power n plus m equals a power n times a power m so we apply this identity right here we are now going to have 9 power 6 times 9 minus 9 power 6 we have 9 power 6 here we have 9 power 6 here we can factor that out so we are now going to have 9 power 6 times 9 minus 1 and this will give us 9 power 6 times 9 minus 1 is 8. Now, so if we can find the value of 9 power 6, we can multiply that by 8 and we will have our final answer. So, how do we go about it? Now, this 9 here is a perfect square. We can have it as 3 power 2. And this is raised to the power of 6. And this is times 8. Now, at this point, we apply this other identity, a power n or power m equals a power n times m. Now, when once we apply this identity right here, we are now going to have 3 power 2 times 6 is 12 times 8. Now, at this point, what we need to do is to find the value of 3 power 12. So, now let's do it this way. 3 instead of this 12 we can have 6 times 2 and this will multiply 8 right now we make use of this identity as well a power n m equals a power n all to the power of m so that's what we're going to apply here that means we are going to have 3 power 6 or power 2 times 8 now we need to find the value of 3 power 6. So 3 power 6 simply means 3 into 6 places. And this is 7 to 9. So that means we are going to have 7 to 9 power 2 times 8. So for the ease of simplification, we can have this 7 to 9 as 700 plus 29 raised to the power of 2 and everything here we are going to multiply it by 8 so let's expand this we simply have 700 plus 29 times 700 plus 29 and everything here we are going to have it multiply 8 so we simply multiply this multiply that multiply this and we multiply that so we are going to have 700 squared plus we have 700 times 29 that will give us 2300 that is 2300 plus the same thing here 29 times 700 is 2300 plus this is 29 squared and everything here we are going to multiply by 8 so 700 squared here is simply 490,000. If you add up everything here, and remember 29 squared here is 841, this alone will give you 531. We have 441, right? Because this 700 squared is 490,000, and this is 841. So it's just to add everything here, this plus, this will give you 4600. Then this is 841. You add everything and you are going to have 53441. Right? That is good enough. Now the next thing is we are going to multiply 53441 by 8. So you can do this one now because this one was a bit very simple. That was why I did not just add it up. So you have 531441 times 8. So Let's carry out this multiplication. 
So we multiply this out. Now, let me write the multiplication sign here. We start 8 times 1 is 8. 8 times 4 is 32. So we write 2 and carry over 3. We have 8 times 4 again is 32. 32 plus 3 that is 35. So we write 5 and still carry over 3. 8 times 1 is 8. 8 plus 3 is 11. We write 1 and carry over 1. Now, 8 times 3 is 24. 24 plus this one here is 25. So what you're going to do is we write 5 and carry over 2. 8 times 5 is 40. 40 plus 2 is 42. So we have 42 here. So our final answer is we have something like 425152. To it. So you can come over here and write it that 9 power 7 minus 9 power 6 equals we have 4, 2, 5, 1, 5, 2, 8. So and we have been able to achieve this without the use of calculator. So that is it. That is 4,251,528. So that is it for this video. I believe you have enjoyed it. Please kindly subscribe, share this video to your friends. Thank you and goodbye.